Hey gang, I'm here with Matthew and the robot arm, the 6C that you've been seeing on our Instagram. And here's the simulation and Matthew's gonna try and drive to get our new gripper that he and Emily built to, to pick up our, our foam block here. So uh, by grabbing those, the manipulator handles you saw in a recent update at marginallyclever.com, he's able to move the preview and we're gonna, we're gonna get that claw to point straight down with a little rotation action. We're gonna stay above the block before we, we actually do the move. So we gotta get close and then we'll, we'll fine tune it from there. So let's try and enter. That, that's how we commit a move. And you can see in real time, it's trying, moving to match the simulation. Now we're gonna move that even further to get that hand to be straight down. Keep going, keep going, that's it, They're very nice. <laughs> There we go. And we probably got enough now that we can slide over and check our move and then down and check our move. That's very nice. Down just a hair. And a bit more. Yeah, and you remember you can fly around the thing if it there's a better angle you can see it at. This is my Factorio LARP. It's, uh, it's going great. It's, it's a team effort. You can find out more about this. We've got a Hackaday I.O. page that hasn't been updated in forever. And you can go to our website at marginallyclever.com. Uh, you can follow us on Instagram, I Make Robots. And now there's a slider way down here at the bottom. That's our temporary thing. If you slide all the way to the right, it's going to grip. We have grip. Now we can pull up and we can move that block somewhere else. Uh, there we go. And lift. Oh! Let's go away from the Perfect. Enter. Very nice, very nice. And so our next step after this will be some speed control, some acceleration control, and being able to program in a sequence of moves that we can repeat again and again and again. And we've also got this sweet joystick here, and when we put a gripper control on that, then you'll be able to drive the arm live from a distance. That's, that's really exciting to me. And that's pretty close to down, a little bit more. We're just about touching. Release the claw. Oh, wonderful, wonderful. So it's a, that's a big improvement. We've finally got a tool on there that we can use. The arm is uh, open source, and of course we're selling it on our website. You can, you can get it in three special flavors, and only one color, any color as long as it's yellow. So I have been Dan, you have been awesome. Thank you for tuning in. Tell all your friends, share this for the free karma, and I will see you next time.